Welcome to video tutorial 11 for the How People Learn book. In the Science Story 8 video tutorial, you learned how to create simple flashcards. How about creating a learning game? Let us show you how the How People Learn game works. After you learn it and play it, all you have to do is copy the mechanics to create your own learning games. Step 1. We've created 42 cards with questions based on the knowledge from the science stories in the How People Learn book, plus some funny self-discovery questions. Step 2. We created 8 Consult the Book cards, which allow the player to consult the How People Learn book to retrieve the correct answer from the book. Step 3. We created 8 star cards that you can use to cover any question you don't want to answer yet by saying pass. Step 4. We created 8 ask an adult cards. These allow the player to consult an adult for the correct answer. Step 5. We created a puzzle out of a picture of the cover of the book. We cut it into 50 small pieces and called these pieces brain power chips. When ready to play, have everyone sit in a circle around a table or on the floor. Mix the cards and give each player five cards. Everyone holds their cards and is allowed to look at them. The remaining play cards are placed face down somewhere in the middle of the circle, visible and accessible to everyone. Going around the circle, each player draws a question card from their deck, places that card in the centre of the circle and answers the question. Each player continues to place their cards in the centre in this way. After each round, players can take one more play card from the remaining deck. If a player doesn't know the answer to a question, she or he can use one of these Save Me cards from their hand of cards to help themselves. Remember, only a few of those cards are available per game, so use them wisely. Every good answer is rewarded with a brain power chip. An answer is considered good if the correct words are given for the fill-in-the-blank cards and honest answers are provided for the funny cards. Just to remind you, a Consult the Book card allows the player to consult the How People Learn book to retrieve the correct answer, and the player still gets a brain power chip if the answer is good. With the Star card, you can cover any question you don't want to answer yet by saying pass, but you still get a brain power chip. It's a unique card, so use it wisely. The Ask an Adult card allows the player to consult an adult for the correct answer, and the player still gets a brain power chip if the answer is good. When you are done playing, you can gather your chips together and see if you have enough of them to assemble the puzzle entirely. Play the game a few times. Then when you feel ready, you can create your own game following the same mechanics. It could be a game to review math calculations or history data basically anything that needs to be learned. Take some pictures with your game and share them with Olympia and the HPL project team via the social media pages. Enjoy being a game designer!